Hello students, our chapter 1 is Network Fundamentals and in this chapter, now we discuss the topic Introduction to Network. Now the question is what is a network? First of all, think about it. Now, a network. A network is a set of devices connected to the communication links. In the given diagram, you see we have so many devices and these devices are connected by some link. The devices may be here, a desktop, a PC, a laptop, a workstation, a cell phone or so many devices. In the network, we also have the connecting devices. These devices may be the router which connects the network to other networks, a switch which connects devices to others, a modem which changes the form of data. We will discuss later about the modem. Modem is generally used to change the data form into signals and signals again into data. And so many devices like gateways or so many security purpose devices. And these old devices are connected through the links as we already defined in the definition. And these links are maybe the wired links or the wireless links. As in the diagram you see, these devices are connected through the wire. And here, this Wi-Fi is making this, Wi-Fi is making a wireless network. This is a wireless network. Wired links means they are maybe connected through the fiber network. Or these are maybe connected through the radio waves radio waves these links are generally to transport a signal which carry the information now from the network as we see go for the definition of the computer network a computer network is a number of computers interconnected by some communication links here the word is interconnected. Two computers are said to be interconnected if they are able to exchange some resources or you can say they are able to exchange information. Now we created a network, we defined the computer network. Now the next question is what is the main objective of network or you can say what is the main purpose of creating a network. Now objective of the network is sharing resources here the resources may be the hardware resources software or the data hardware we see the example of an hardware in our laboratories or in library you see two or three pcs are using a common printer they give command to print and take print out from that printer they are sharing that common printer now softwares as we see so many service providers are providing software services on the basis of rentals in the cloud computing we see uh, our pas sas and ias now the data uh, if we uh, discuss about the data our day to day life example is whatsapp through the whatsapp we are the part of some networks and we are sharing photos audio video or some pdf file with our friends means generally we are exchanging data now this is all about the network computer network and what is the main purpose of network now if we see an example of network in our day-to-day -day life example is home network home network we see in our day-to-day -day life in our homes we have a cable means a service providers provide us the service of internet and here i am using a modem this modem is changing the coming signal into the data and in our homes if we are connecting the devices like our pc or some uh, wi-fi or anything through the lan cable we, then then we can use a switch also and here the this wi-fi is creating the wireless network and the switch is connecting a wired network. So, as in the journal, we can say in our homes, through the routers or through the Wi-Fi, we are making 
a wireless network and our devices cell phones or our uh, laptops or some other uh, devices like uh, our airtel extremes these are all connected through that wi-fi and we are using the internet services that means we are making a network and we are using the services for that network this is all about the network thank you